Hi, a couple of things on the Arctic 10. So it's a Samsung board uh, built on Exynos uh, SOC. And to use it, you have to plug your USB micro USB ad adapter here for the debug link. It's a regular UART. Then you need to switch on the power supply, 5 volt, 5 amp. And uh, you need to press the power button on the right side. Wait a couple of seconds. And then hold uh, this uh, switch number 3 near to the Ethernet port for a few seconds. And uh, your boot will start. And you have a regular Linux distribution. It's based on Fedora. I will not explain too much for today. It's, it's explained as well, so you figure it out. So what I'm going to explain is how to put uh, uh, your home system on a SD card and run it from HIT. This can be convenient for a developer. So I switch it off. On this side we have the boot selector switch. Uh, if it's brand new you have this small adhesive pay tape on top of it. I remove it. I remove it. I remove it. Uh, so on the left side it is booting to the EMMC. If you move the both of the switch to the right side, both of, both of them, um, then you'll be able to boot from the SD card. So I just need to pour it on again. Wait uh, a couple of seconds. And then hold this uh, switch number 3. Okay, system is booting now. I can move my quad. It's uh, this Exynos chip has a uh, 8 core running on it, so we can see uh, 8 jux uh, over there. And I can just uh, make a short demonstration with my keyboard. I just need to log in. It's a Yocto Poki distribution with IoTVT running on it, so I can just run put it uh, login without uh, any password and I have a small sample which is an IoT server sharing a, a fake position of a, of a GPS and uh, here is a Tizen device I use this uh, demonstration for other use cases but uh, we run this IoT client and it will uh, connect to the same network and uh, update uh, the actual position Okay, so here is a map of the position uh, which is updated in real time. So we have a high activity running on uh, this side as a client and uh, a server on uh, this other board and we are communicating on the same network, it is using IP, but uh, it can also use different protocol like uh, Bluetooth, Bluetooth Low Energy and uh, thread, I think there is a lot of uh, connectivity feature on this Arctic 10. So that's all. If you have some question, you can find me online and uh, ask some question. I will publish uh, this uh, on several communities. And thank you for listening. Goodbye.